guys welcome to a new video so in this video we are going to learn how to change the label color of a material slider actually i am doing this video because it's it's very hard to find a correct answer for uh, things like this like this minor changes so i am making a simpler video to you people to understand so if you are new here make sure to uh, subscribe the channel and like the video for more contents like this and if you have any request make sure to uh, tell me it in the comment section so uh, I'm going to uh, show you how we can change the label color here. Uh, actually, I'm using a material slider. As you can see, I'm using a material slider in my uh, activity refine. Uh, so we can change the thumb color, uh, the progress tint, thumb tint, etc. Di directly from the uh, XML right here. But there is no option to change this uh, label color. So uh, uh, it, it stands out. So if you want to change this, uh, uh, actually, I tried uh, uh, searching answers in ChatGPT, Stack Overflow, and even YouTube, but uh, it's very hard to find an answer, correct answer. There are so many solutions, but most of them are not working, and some of them are just useless. So, uh, uh, I'm going to show you the right way to do this, to change the label color. So, if you go to the official uh, material uh, design designs website, we can select the slider components from here. Uh, so, if you go to here uh, and just go to the themings of sliders here if you go here you can see uh, there are some uh, styling of slider here but we don't need everything we only need two things we need this part from this part here where there is background tint background tint just copy this code and also copy this code where we apply the label style to this uh, to this one widget.app.tooltip so make sure to copy this uh, style here where it contains a label style and copy this uh, style for where it contains background tint. I have already done that. If we go to my uh, themes.xml, uh, you can see that here. I have both of them here. And I have deleted that these two things. I mean the uh, Android text appearance and material theme overlay. I have deleted those two. I have only used the background tint in the widget.app.tooltip. And in the widget.app.slider, I have only uh, used the label style. Uh, so that's it. That's how we. Uh, up, change the color uh, not not how that's how we apply the color so make sure to copy this and this part if you only want to change the color of that label there are other things to too, like uh, text color uh, phone family and uh, phone uh, other things like that so make sure to copy this too for the label color the label background color and after that inside your uh, theme stored xml make sure to uh, paste it if it's uh, different for your dark theme make sure to also paste it inside the uh, themes.xml night so after that inside your activity or fragment whatever it is here we have a style property so you can just uh, add that style property here and just link it to the widget.app.slider uh, we have a uh, widget.app.tooltip and widget.app.slider we need to use widget.app.slider because we uh, implement the background tint inside widget.app.tooltip and we apply the style inside uh, widget.app.slider label style so uh, make sure to uh, note that and inside activity dot, uh, your activity or fragment just uh, apply the style that will here you can see that also in the documentation if you go to here you can see how to apply the style uh, just a second yeah here you can see this is how you apply the uh, style uh, so make sure to check the official documentation before going for uh, any direct answers in stack overflow or uh, chat gpt it will also improve you as a developer so that's a, that's a thing that i done so uh, i found the right answer by doing that so it's a good way to find uh, right answers so if this video helped you make sure to uh, subscribe and like the video so that's it guys uh, uh, this is the this is before restarting my app let me show you after restarting the app currently it's the default gray color if i restart the app now it will change to my primary color so let's wait for some time as you can see now we have suc successfully changed our label color uh, so that's how we do it so that's it guys uh, bye see you in the next video